Good afternoon, kids. I'm so glad you're here again with Miss Leah. So today for our afternoon activity is that we are going to practice writing the letters that we have learned so far, okay? Do you remember which letters they are? Come with me and we are going to write them. Come on. First letter was the letter F. F, F, F. And here's the letter F. Now let's practice drawing it. You're going to make a vertical line going down, stop, go back up to the top and make a horizontal line going across and another one going across but shorter than the top one. And there you have F, that's capital F and this is how you do little F. It's almost like you're gonna do a little candy cane Go up and around, down, stop. And then you make a line going over. And there you have F. Next letter is the letter C. And C has two sounds, K, hard C, and S, soft C. And the C is written as if you're about to make a circle. So we're gonna do capital C. You're gonna put your marker on the paper and go around, just like you're about to do a circle, but then stop. And guess what? Little c is just like big c, except you just make the c smaller. Put your marker on the paper and you go around as if you're about to do a circle and then stop. And there is c. Remember this letter? Yes, this is the letter L. And L makes the L sound, like for lion and Miss Leah. So when you make your L, you're going to make a. Okay, so when you make your L, you're going to put your marker on the paper and you're going to make a vertical line going down. Stop and then a horizontal line going across. And there you have your L, that's capital L. And little L is just a line coming down. That's it, L. Next letter is the letter T. T, 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 T. And T has, and how we write T is you make a line Vertical line going down, stop, come back up to the top, and you're gonna make a horizontal line going across. And there you have capital T. And little t is a vertical line going down. And then right in the middle of that vertical line is where you're going to do a horizontal line going across. And there you have capital T and little t. Next letter is the letter B, 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 which begins, the word bread begins with the letter B that we're talking about, bread. And B, the way we make B is you make a, you wanna draw a vertical line going down, come back up to the top, and you're gonna go around into the middle and then go back and do another half a circle. And there you have your B, capital B. And little b is a vertical line going down. And right here in the middle, you're gonna give your line a belly. And there you have small b. What sound does b make? B, 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 b. And here is the last letter that we are learning so far, the letter p, 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 p. And p, the way we make p is you want to put your marker on the paper and you're gonna make a vertical line going down and then come back up to the top and you're gonna curve your line going around into the middle. Almost like the B, but you're not gonna give them another 
a curvy line. You're going to stop right there. Okay? And that's how we do P. And guess what? Just like C, we're going to do the P the same way as the capital letter. So the little P, same thing. Vertical line going down. And then you come back up to the top here. And you're going to curve your line around like a circle and stop. So you have big P and little P. What sound does P make? P, P, P. Yes, like for purple, like the marker Miss Lee is using. So kids, I hope you liked that little review exercise of the letters that we have learned so far. And what I would like for you to do is practice. Keep practicing those letters. How many letters were there? Six. There were six letters that we've learned so far. And we have a lot more to go. So practice your letters, all right? And Miss Lee will see you tomorrow. Bye, kids.